Well, it was a good weekend uh, by first weekend standards. You know, the, it's always going to be with such a short preseason in our sport. The first weekend for 100% of teams, I would assume, is a little bit rough. And you just hope that you can make mistakes and still win soccer games. And we were able to accomplish that this weekend. We weren't perfect. We did a lot of things great. I think the most important thing this weekend for us was just we had a total team effort from everybody. Um, every player that was on the bench, every substitute that came in the game, regardless of how many minutes everybody played, there was a lot of energy from the entire team and a lot of uh, support, and that's needed to set a tone for your, your team's spirit, and I think we did that in the opening weekend. Um, I thought that we came out a weekend, our weekend was really well, really good. Um, coming off with a first official win feels awesome. Um, we were able to move the ball, switch a point of attack. I thought this year um, we we're looking really strong as a team. Um, going into the weekend, we need to work on a little bit more composure, making sure and finishing our opportunities. Those are going to be the two biggest things that are going to um, help us in our game against NC State tomorrow. From a soccer standpoint, we, you know, we just weren't clean yet with the ball. We put ourselves under a lot more pressure sometimes than we needed to be by overcomplicating the game. And we got ourselves into some really, really good spots and could have created a significant amount of more dangerous chances, but maybe our first touch was just off or we didn't open up into a big space or the pass was just a little bit too heavy. So we'll be trying to refine you know, and clean up our skill a little bit, um, clean up our technique and tactically evolve a little bit over the next couple of weeks. Um, we just worked on uh, finding the ball, throwing throw-ins. Um, we've talked about um, finishing. We've done a lot of crossing and finishing, um, which I think has honestly, since day one of preseasons, improved significantly, and that is going to help us um, to our success in the season. Well, it's hard to know what to expect from them. They've been on the West Coast for the first two games, and uh, we haven't been able to get scouting reports. So I'm not that worried. Uh, right now about what they're doing. I think every a lot of programs in the country are more worried about how they're going to evolve themselves and continue to establish their own game. And that's our approach going into Thursday's game. We know what we want to do. We're going to attempt to execute. If we need to make some adjustments on the fly according to what NC State's doing or not doing, then that's part of the game. But going into NC State, the keys for us are to keep building on some of the tactical approaches that we've tried in preseason for the last four weeks. We haven't changed anything. Um, continue to get some, some kids on the field that we need to evaluate and see how they're going to do in some pressure situations. And I think NC State's going to provide a significant challenge for us. Um, anytime you get a chance as a you know, mid-major to play a team out of the, the country's top conference, um, that's a great opportunity for us. And we're looking forward to Thursday.